guys and welcome back to my channel so for today's video i have a sephora haul for you guys um have not bought anything from sephora in a hot minute so i'm pretty excited to show you guys what i got so i bought all of this stuff during the sephora sale and i feel like it kind of took a hot minute to get here to be honest with you but uh i'm really excited for everything that's here so the very first thing i got is this sol de janeiro kit which I am obsessed with. So this is the Galaxy Gorgeous Kit. It comes with the moisturizing shower cream gel, the body scrub, the cream, which is what I needed. I was out of it. And then it comes with the um, fragrance mist. Ooh, it's also a hair and body fragrance mist. Interesting. Okay, so let's look at the sizes. I'm pretty sure the only thing that is full size is the spray and then the bum bum cream. Um, so, yeah, the only thing that's full size is these two products, but I'm excited to try the, I've had the shower gel before, but I'm excited to try the body scrub. Very, very excited. I think I'm going to put this in my car. So, yeah, and I absolutely love this scent more than anything ever. It is the best smelling stuff on the freaking planet what i do is i will put this on right after i take a shower um i only use it on the days when i wash my hair so like two times a week um but i will put it on after i get out of the shower and it will literally last me days even after i have showered again like it will continue to smell that way it's amazing um okay so then the next thing i got is this ilia super serum skin tint i got the shade diaz um who talks about this Danny Austin raves about this, like raves, raves, raves about it. So I decided to pick it up. Um, I'm wanting something with a little bit, sorry. I'm wanting something with a lighter coverage, um, but it's still like good for you and has like an SPF in it. And this has SPF, it has uh, niacinamide, squalene, and hyaluronic acid, which is awesome. I didn't realize it had all that stuff in it, but I am very excited to try this out. I know that it is like a light coverage, which that's what I was wanting. But just so you guys know, um, I am going to read the side of this because there's a bunch of information there. So it is clean, silicone and fragrance free, a tinted serum packed with active nourishing ingredients. It has non nano zinc oxide SPF 40. So I don't know what that means, but it sounds good. Um, and then it is a weightless formula, light coverage, and dries down to a natural dewy finish, which we love to hear. Um, Plant-based plant squalene, which is really good for you, helps to balance skin and improve elasticity, while niacinamide aids in smoothing texture, which awesome. I am needing that. I don't know why, but I think it's like with aging. Um, my skin is starting to get like a little bit more texture that I've never had in my entire life. Um, and then like my nose is starting to get texture. And again, I've never had that in my entire life. So I don't know where that's coming from, but I'm not here for it. And then the next thing I got is the ordinary, I don't know how to say that word at all. Ar Argoline, Argoline, um, solution 10%. It targets the appearance of dynamic facial lines. Um, so I was looking online to get rid of these, uh, little, Oh, you can clearly see them right there. I have my ring light up above, so if the lighting's off, I apologize. It's probably not doing anything for, like, my appearance whatsoever. It's probably honestly making the fine lines and the texture on my skin more prominent. So I apologize, but I'm trying to get rid of these fine lines right here because <laughs> apparently I'm freaking old now. Um, and so I literally Googled, like, best treatment for spine lines or whatever and like this is the first thing that came up and I like looked up a bunch of different things on fine lines and everybody recommended this so I'm really excited to try this out and as you guys know the ordinary is super affordable so I'm so excited to see if this works and you could like definitely save a heckin bunch of money if that works okay the next thing i got is this olaplex kit this is the shine bright kit it comes with the number three the number four number five and then the number seven so the um like treatment then the shampoo conditioner and then the bonding oil um this is only 60 dollars, and then obviously during the sale it was even cheaper and that is a pretty dang good deal um, I have tried everything except for the oil, so I'm excited to try that. I actually have the number three 
um, in my bathroom right now. And I love the shampoo and conditioner. Let me tell you guys, it really, really does make, like it really seriously makes a difference. Um, I thought before I bought it, like the very first time I ever bought it, I was like, yeah, like this is definitely not going to be worth the hype. No, it really is. It's actually a really, really good product. Um, and then I also got the Olaplex, um, it's number four P blonde enhancer toning shampoo. Um, immediately whenever I saw that they came out with a purple shampoo, I was like, um, yes, yes, please. Yes, please. My hair is very, very yellow right now. And I don't, I don't know why I don't understand it, but it's like literally the toner is coming out like that, like it's gone now. So I'm very excited to try this out. I'm using the Pureology purple shampoo right now like the shampoo and conditioner and, and uh, I'm not super impressed. It's all right. But like for the price, I expected more. Okay. And then I got the super gloop, super goop glow sunscreen. And this is SPF 40. Um, I'm very excited for this because I want to start taking better care of my skin. Um, and so I want to start wearing, um, SPF every single day. And this one, y'all know, this one's like very, very highly rated. Everybody freaking raves about this. So I'm excited to try this one out. This one has like a slight glow to it, which y'all know, I love the glow. And I'm hoping that this will kind of be like a good substitute for the Becca Blacklight Priming Filter because you know, they just went away. Um, and that was my favorite primer of all time. So I'm hoping this has like the same glow, but it's got, you know, like the added benefit of having a spiff in it. Okay, then two more things. This is the glow recipe. Mm, this is the glow recipe watermelon glow neocyamide dewdrops. Um, it's a highlighting serum. Um, I'm very excited for this. So, as you guys may or may not know, I loved, loved, loved the Barsali Unicorn Essence. And for whatever reason, I got rid of that. Um, I loved it for if I just wanted like a little bit of like, if I just wanted to use like a natural look, I would put that on and just put like a little bit of concealer on and it just gave the most prettiest glow. And so I'm hoping that will also kind of like benefit this. And then again, I like the Becca Blacklight Priming Filter. So I'm hoping this will kind of be like a good, like in between of both of those um, because I love all of the glow. And I absolutely love Glow Recipe. I think it is a great brand. Their watermelon slip, nope. Their watermelon sleeping mask is absolutely amazing. If you have not tried it, telling you literally go on Sephora's website and buy it right now because it will change your life. It is amazing. Okay, and then the very last thing I got was the Natasha Denona I Need a Nude Lipstick. This is in this shade Amarosa. Um, I will say, um, so I did swatch this on my hand um, as soon as this came in, because I was so excited for it. I'll go ahead and put it on my lips right now. Um, I will say that whenever I swatched this on my hand, it did not look the same as the pictures on Sephora. Like it looked very, very different. So I'm pretty disappointed in that. And I feel like it looks very, very peachy on me, at least on camera. I don't know so much in real life, but um, it just doesn't look anything like the picture. And so I was extremely disappointed in that. Um, I mean, it honestly doesn't even look like the sticker on here, but whatever. I think the packaging is so cute. I love that it's pink and it looks very, very sleek and like good quality. Um, I just wish that it was actually like the cut, like looked like how it looked online. I mean, it's not a bad color. It's just not what I was wanting. I am getting hungry. Let me tell you. I'm also uh, sipping on a mango white claw. Mm. Delicious. Okay. But that is it for this video thank you guys so so much for watching i know that i didn't get a ton of stuff um thank you guys so 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 much for watching please subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you guys in the next one